look and this is the final product what do you think I wanted something that was glamorous but not like over the top because it's lunch not dinner so I wasn't going to do like a smoky eye or anything so very light makeup I got some bronze on of course I self tanned yesterday because I was looking quite pale and it was not cute. I'm really happy with how this look turned out. This dress was not my first choice. The one I ordered is being delivered tomorrow, so that's obviously a day too late. So I needed to stop by Topshop and pick this one up. This is from House of CB. Um, was not a first choice, a second choice, not even a sixth or seventh choice. But um, I tried it on just as I was about to leave defeated because I couldn't find a dress I liked. And I'm like, oh, you know what? Like, the girls, they're sitting. This is cute. Like, it's still conservative-ish, but it's, like, sexy at the same time. So, yeah, I'm very happy. For jewelry, I'm wearing a necklace from Forever 21. This is a little rose. I don't know if you guys can see. And then, of course, my love bracelet and then my acrylic Hermes one. And then with this look, I'm going to be wearing my Fendi peekaboo and my Dior slingbacks because the dress is black, the shoes are black and white, and then my bag is white. So it's going to be really cute. Everything is going to tie in so nicely together. So I just need to put on my shoes, transfer everything to my Fendi, and then I will see you guys at lunch. bracelet for a very long time um, a couple months ago I had a dream with one in it like I saw it next to my Cartier love bracelet and I'm like oh that's so fabulous I need that it's as good as mine so the goal is to find one today and um, yeah that is something I'm really really excited for because I already tried a couple on if you guys have followed me on snapchat and Instagram you will have seen that 
but um, I'm basically going to pick one for sure today and then I'm gonna go relax in the room for a bit probably touch up my makeup you know it's not looking too bad TBH and then I'm headed to a surprise Valentine's performance at Lincoln Center which I'm very excited for because I've never been I've been to Carnegie Hall a couple times and it's really nice but apparently Lincoln Center is like a different experience so that's gonna be a good time if I can I will film but I know most concert halls don't like love that concept so we will see what I can do and yeah I'm gonna hurry up because the diamond store is closing in like 10 minutes so i will see you guys there I'm gonna take you guys along for that as well. And yeah. Quick side note, I was looking at my Fendi bag while I was in the restrooms earlier and I realized that this corner, you guys probably can't see, but on the hem, there's a red stain. And that is from the very first time I wore it when I was in Hong Kong. Um, or Kuala Lumpur and I was taking photos for Instagram and I was wearing this like beautiful bright red gown but something about the fabric just like rubbed off of my purse and stained it. I'm outside now because I needed to head to eat because I'm starving so yeah I'm really sad about my bag but it's whatever I guess I'll survive maybe Take your bubbly. So much footage on this camera from like months. Ago. Yeah. Even Nothing. My oh no. So what are you gonna do with it all? I'm gonna upload it and edit it. It's just I have to actually do it. Oh, and it's such a lengthy process. <laughs> have fun. This here are two champagne teas. They put both your orders into one tier. Also split right across in the middle, so it mirrors from each other. You have your uh, pastries, sandwiches, bottom or your scones, which are plain and cranberries for today. And for the sandwiches, you have your prime rib, lobster roll, you have a, a crab, red um, beets, foie gras, and middle are going to be your caviar with the meat. So cute. The attention to detail, the gold cone. Amazing. They did not let us down. I imagine it would be cilantro. It might be basil. I hate cilantro with the passion. Really? You're one of those people? Yeah, I get a lot of 
<laughs> you don't feel like eating soap. What is this green? Oh my god, it does taste like That's what people who don't like cilantro think. It tastes like thing. perfume yes. grass. Just soap. Delicious. Yeah, perfume grass, soap, same thing. <laughs> okay. There's a lot of bread. Yeah. <laughs> That's my very first thought. I think I'm gonna reduce said bread by half. Mm hmm Okay, so now my appointment's at 8 p.m. So <laughs> What we ate. Yeah, they're like, that's the only time I got. That'll be nice then, kind of end your day. Exactly, that's why I was thinking about it. And then that means I can actually go home and take off my makeup beforehand. I did bring like makeup wipes, and I'm like, I'm not gonna be that chick who goes in with a full face of makeup and is like, give me a facial. Like, I was gonna try and remove it. I don't it. even wear makeup. Like, I, really I wear normally makeup don't. Oh, same. So, we just finished our afternoon tea. We're walking around and taking some photos because this place is stunning. As you guys can see, it's absolutely gorgeous. Look at these palm trees. Thoughts on the plaza? Five out of five. Five out of five. Would recommend. Would recommend. You heard it here first. Were amazing. Yeah. Five Too much five. chocolate though. Hey guys, so I just finished at the plaza. We had an amazing afternoon tea. It got tons of great footage. An amazing time with my girlfriend. I also got leftovers, so I'm not mad about that. But because our lunch ran so long, I had to reschedule my facial. So instead of going right now, I'm going to be going later on tonight. I changed my appointment to 8 p.m., which is something I've never done before. I've never had such a late facial, but um, I'm not mad about it because I think that that's gonna be a great way to wind down my day. Like, I'm gonna be so relaxed and it's gonna be a great time. So yeah, I'm just gonna head back to the hotel, take off my makeup because there's no reason for me to have all this on my face. I'm like done filming for the day. So I'm doing that and then I'm hitting the gym and relaxing for a few hours before I head to my facial. I'm going to be including that footage as well. So please stick around to see that. But this is the end of the vlog. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed all the footage of my beautiful afternoon tea. If you haven't already, please do like and subscribe. It would mean the world to me. Thank you again so much for watching and I'll see you next time.